Um, good day guys, Galino here. Welcome back to our channel. So for today's video, we will install and deploy a printer. Okay. So we will install the printer here on the server and then right after, we will deploy it through group policy. Okay, so let's start. Okay, so I have here a driver or a printer driver for Epson L120. Okay, so actually guys, ang mga in-install na printer talaga sa server, dapat mga network printer. But this one is a uh, USB printer. But, papakita ko po sa inyo yung pag-install and pag-deploy. So, I'll run the driver. Okay, so same din po doon sa ating uh, previous video na with regards to printer installation. Ganun din po. Ganun din po yung procedure but uh, this time po, uh, meron po itong uh, deployment na mangyayari doon sa ating mga uh, client users. Okay, so I guess I'll check this. So I'm going to click OK. Then I agree on the uh, license agreement. Click OK. So make sure po na nakaturn na ng ating uh, printer and at the same time nakakonect na po sa ating um, server. Okay, so install this driver anyway. Okay, so it's installed now. Okay, so I'll just close this. And now, let's go to the print management. Okay, so kinakailangan na install yung print and document services para magkameron kayo na print management. Okay, so, in the administrative tools, you'll find there the print management. Okay. So, expand print servers, expand your computer, and then expand the printers. Or click the printers. Okay. So, here, nandito po yung ating install na printer, Epson L120 series. Then, i-deploy po natin ito para pagkalagin po nung ating mga users, Meron na po agad sila naka-install na printer sa kanila and then they can print na po after that. So right click, deploy with group policy and then click browse. So doon po sa ating dalawang uh, users, Roger Fed and Tracy Mac under accounting uh, department, okay? Um, doon po natin i-deploy yung Epson L120. Then after po, we will install a printer driver and then i-deploy naman natin po siya doon sa isang department. So, accounting department, accounting.mctech.com, double click, and then double click the GPO. Then, the users that uh, this GPO applies to, and the computers that this GPO applies to. Okay, so, check po natin to, then click add. Then, click apply, then click OK, and then click OK. Then, dito po, mag-install tayo ng uh, printer driver. So, magsiselect na lang po tayo kung sino manufacturer. Okay? Para, para meron tayo yung dalawang uh, installed printers. So, right-click printers here. Add printer. And then, um, add a new printer using an existing port. So, kung may network printer po tayo, so, yun po, dito po tayo sa uh, search the network for printers. Okay, pwede rin po itong add a TCP IP or web services printer by IP address or host name. Pero ang gagamitin po natin ay existing port, LPT1. So add a new printer here. Then add a new printer using an existing port. Okay. So select na lang po natin is LPT1. Okay, for example, then click next. And then install a new driver. Click next. So for example, Epson or Canon or Brother. So yeah, pili lang po tayo. So, I'll just choose Canon, and then I'll select the first one, Canon Inkjet IP100 series, then click Next. Okay, so share this printer, click Next, then click Next. Finish. So now, meron po tayong dalawang printer na install Isang Epson L120 and Inkjet IP100 series. So, check lang po natin yung kanyang 
properties here. Surely. Okay, so check po natin yung share this printer. Okay, and then apply. Okay. So yung po ang ating uh, current object, ganun din po, ide-deploy din po natin, right click, deploy with group policy, browse, and for this time naman po, human resource, this ating isang user. Double click, and then double click the GPO, check the checkboxes, click add, apply, OK, and then OK. So yun po, install tayo ng printer, and dineploy din po natin. So si Epson po para sa accounting, and then si Canon para dun po sa ating um, human resource department. Okay, so maglalagin po tayo. Okay, so now we'll go to start. So right click start, settings, then go to devices, then printers and scanners, and yun po. Epson L120 series on DC1. So this one po yung ating server. So ito po talaga siya naka-install and dineploy natin. Now, we'll go to the uh, user for human resource department. Okay, so I'll just sign this out. So yun naman po yung install natin na uh, na printer for the human resource is the Canon. Plug-in na po tayo. Okay, so now let's go to start. Right-click start, settings. Okay, ito po yung sa human resource na user. Then devices, and then printers and scanners. So ito po, cannot inject IP100 series on DC1. So yun po. Uh, break up lang tayo. Nag-install tayo ng uh, printer na Epson and Canon, then dineploy po natin yung Epson sa accounting uh, department and then yun naman po Canon ay para sa human resource department so yung check po natin yun, nag-login tayo as accounting user so lumabas po yung Epson on DC1 and then Canon for the human resource user okay, so thank you for watching and see you on my next videos, goodbye